Gaining increased prominence, project-based learning is an educational pedagogy in which students are naturally led to learning through self-directed projects in collaboration with their peers. It has also proven effective in enhancing 21st century skills, or the four C's, communication, collaboration, critical thinking, and creativity. However, despite the increasing number of countries jumping on the bandwagon and implementing their own PBL models, Korea's implementation of PBL was ranked the lowest in the world according to the OECD. Accordingly, KDI evaluated the effects of PBL on the development of key future competencies and explored the necessary reforms for Korea's education system. Two middle schools in Daegu were selected to be the treatment group and a PBL program was initiated with Daegu Metropolitan Office of Education for freshman students during the free semester of 2015. Teachers were also provided with consulting services. To compare, three nearby middle schools were selected as a control group. Baseline and endline surveys were conducted in all five schools and changes in communication and collaboration as well as an academic achievement were examined. To measure communication skill, students were asked to list three closest classmates to assess the friendship network in class. Here, a higher probability of the chosen classmates being friends indicates a stronger peer network. The results show that there are indeed changes in the students' relationship with their classmates as a result of the PBL program. The probability of the three chosen classmates being friends increased by approximately 20% point implying that PBL was effective in strengthening peer networks. For collaboration skill, games in which the students' interests were in conflict with those of the entire class were designed to measure the level of consideration and cooperation. In the public good game, for example, students were given 2001 to invest in both a personal and class account at their discretion. Students received 100% of the amount in the personal account while receiving 10% of the total amount in the class account regardless of how much they each invested. The results show that compared to the students in the control group, those in the treatment group saved approximately 8% more in the class account, suggesting that students' willingness to trust and cooperate for the common good was enhanced. 분석 결과를 종합해 보면 학업 성취도는 하락하지 않았으나 교우 관계는 더욱 공고해졌고요. 그 결과 학생들의 상호 신뢰와 협력 수준이 향상되었다는 것을 관찰하였습니다. 이러한 결과는 프로젝트 학습이 미래 역량으로 주목받고 있는 소통과 협업 능력을 향상시킬 수 있다는 가능성을 보여줍니다. 한편 이번 연구는 새로운 수업 방식이 시도되기 비교적 쉬운 자유학기 중에 실시되었다는 점에 주목할 필요가 있습니다. 앞으로 자유학기가 아닌 일반 학기 중에도 교실 수업의 혁신이 발생할 수 있게끔 교과 과정과 입시 제도의 변화가 필요합니다. 어, 프로젝트 학습은 우리 교육개혁의 중요한 출발점이자 그 핵심이라고 할수 있습니다. 프로젝트 학습을 어, 자유학기제 학생들에게 집중을 하면 또 자유학기제가 성공할 수 있는 굉장히 중요한 계기가 될수 있고요. 또 프로젝트 학습의 결과를 어, 수행평가를 통해서 입학사정관들에게 제출한다면 어, 입시제도의 발전에도 굉장히 중요한 계기가 될수 있습니다. 이 프로젝트 학습을 한 학교들이 늘어나도록 어, 교사 연수를 정부가 지원한다든지 또 교육청이 어, 교사들에 대해서 컨설팅을 계속 해준다든지 하는 식으로 해서 프로젝트 학습 학교를 늘려가는 아래, 아래로부터의 개혁 방식이 중요하다고 생각합니다.